Why? A long I don't even deserve this. <laughs> Excuse me, miss. Something wrong? Does it look like something's wrong? Well, you look kind of upset about something. Perhaps you don't understand what it's like to be disgraced as a woman. To have people gossip about you and turn from you in disgust day after day. People can be real unkind, that's for sure. Yeah, I'm Clara. I used to be a nanny for a family here in Blackwater. The father, he was always so charming. My fool that I was fell for him. Mrs. Thornton, his wife, kicked me out on the street as soon as I started showing. Mr. Thornton turned a drink. Not even a farewell. For a dollar. I have nothing. They will surely take my baby from me. Perhaps you could find the dissolute bastard. Get even a few dollars for me and my baby to find a home. I would be so grateful, sir. I'll see what I can do. Excuse me. You know a girl named Clara? What's that? Is she one of the waitresses around here? No, she was a servant at your house. The only servant we had was that wee darky girl, Sarah. And she left to join the people up north. <sighs> no, she helped raise your children. You and her had an intimacy of sorts. Look here, laddie. I'm not sure what you're accusing me of. I'm just here to enjoy the tables. Not to hear expressions against my character. I understand you want to keep this quiet. Just give me a few dollars so she can set up a modest household for her and the child. You put your mind, laddie, or you're just a common criminal, a nerve, are you? You think you can blackmail me or insult me over this piffle? You, outside, no! Excuse me, mister.
everything okay, man? No. Let's go. Hey, Clara. Hello, mister. Got you some money. Oh, you are very kind, very kind. And how's Harold? How's my Harold? Didn't go so well. well. I'm afraid he's dead. Dead? <gasps> Unfortunately so. I, I, I must go to his grave. Afraid I don't know where that is. Oh, he'll be buried in the cemetery in the family plot. If I hurry, I could... I can make it to his funeral.
infamous John Marshall. I'd love to spend some time with you, Cowboy. I don't think that's a good idea. Good idea. Hello, ma'am. Oh. My condolences. Oh, my dear Harold, I can't believe he's gone. I knew his frequenting that gambling boat would be the death of him. The death of him. Oh, oh, Harold Thornton, I miss you. I see. I heard that dog. Trollop Clara laughing at the funeral. I can't understand how strangers can be so cruel. The world is a sad and terrible place. God preserve his soul. I'm sorry for your loss, ma'am. Take care. Ha <laughs> ha.